follow all the different individual killer whales on the coast of British Columbia every year since the early 1970s. And we know really quite a lot about their social dynamics, their population structure, and, uh, and now their acoustics. Whales make different kinds of sounds for different purposes. They have very, very distinctive dialects that uh, we can use to tell these different groups apart. What I'm going to play here are um, some sounds from J-Pod. It's a southern resident killer whale group that's found off Victoria, southern Vancouver Island. What you listen for is a flat tone that ends with a descending tone. And now if we played a different group, this is the A-Pods. And you can hear that they go up in pitch at the end and the, the actual calls themselves are very, very different. So those are what we call stereotype calls and they're, they are a little package of sound that is repeated over and over again by all the individuals in the group or in the pod. And this provides us with a really useful tool to remotely track the movements of these whales. Looks like he may still be chasing the salmon. His sonar clicks here. You can hear that clicking of the sonar as the whale approaches. In the summertime, these resident pods congregate around both ends of Vancouver Island, but when the salmon are primarily up the river, the whales leave those kind of core summer feeding areas and move to areas that uh, we haven't yet identified very well. And it's very difficult to find them on the high seas when, uh, when it's rough and they're small whales. Mm -hmm. 